Hello, my wonderful little friends. This is your girl, Soleil, back again with another wonderful video. I hope you're excited. If you have not subscribed yet, go ahead, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to get the latest videos. If you like it, go ahead and share it with your friends. I have a question for you. Do you know which is better, fruits or vegetables? Well, today we're going to be reading the story about which is better. I hope you're excited. Go ahead, grab a chair, sit back, relax, and enjoy. Which is better, fruits or vegetables? Let's find out as we dive into the story. A long, long time ago, deep into the forest, there was a little girl named Mimi. Mimi lived in the forest with many animals like squirrels, rabbits, deers, you name it. I mean, all sorts of animals. One day, the animals were out playing in the woods. When they were talking amongst themselves to figure out which is better, fruits or vegetables. One monkey said, You see, bananas are delicious. It gives me lots of energy to swing around these trees. One rabbit says, No way! Vegetables are so much better. You see, carrots are so delicious and crunchy, and it gives me energy to bounce up and down. Look! Look at my beautiful teeth! Look how sharp and strong they are! Mimi said, All right, all right, everybody, calm down. We'll settle this once and for all. We will have a competition to see who can eat the most fruit or vegetables in one minute. And sure enough, the next day, all the animals were so excited and they were so ready for the competition. They were chit-chatting, talking amongst themselves about who was going to win this competition. So, the bunnies got a team called the Puff Puff Bunnies and the monkeys got a team called the Funky Monkeys. Mimi started off the competition. On your mark, get set, eat. All right, the Puff Puff Bunnies started off really strong. They were using their teeth to break through the carrots like a machine. While, oh my goodness, the monkeys were peeling each banana one by one. Oh, that's so sad. I don't think they have a chance. Wait a second. One of the Puff Puff Bunnies bit too hard on a carrot and broke a tooth. Oh, what a disappointment. The Puff Puff Bunnies are down one. Now the Funky Monkeys are in the lead. Look at that. They're catching up. Wait a minute. I spoke too soon. One of the Funky Monkeys ate a rotten banana and got sick. Oh, man. What a setback. Oh, now it's two Puff Puff Bunnies against two Funky Monkeys. Oh, the race looks pretty tight, my friends. Oh, no. Wait. I spoke too soon. The Puff Puff Bunnies ate a carrot with a stem on it. Oh, what a bummer. Now the Funky Monkeys are in the lead. <gasps> Oh no, I spoke too soon. One of the bananas got stuck in the monkey's throat. Oh, just when you think this race was over, it's now getting interesting. Now it's one against one. Who will win this race? I can't look. I can't look. Five, four, three, two, one. The buzzer went off. Both the Puff Puff Bunny and the Funky Monkey fell down from exhaustion. As Mimi looked down to tally up the total, she announces the winner. Mimi says, mm -mm -mm -mm. It's a tie. <gasps> All the animals started to cheer. We now know that both fruits and vegetables are good for you to eat and contains lots of vitamins and minerals. So, eat up, my friends. Eat as much fruits and vegetables as you can to keep you growing strong and healthy. And so, from that day on, all the animals never complained or argued about which was better. <laughs>